We are back at the Olympic capital of Lausanne. Scott Russell along with Carol Orchard as our coverage of the World Gymnastics Championships continues. Rotation three and Elena Prodenova of Russia to the uneven bar. And what an exciting addition she is to the Russian team. Huge tricks like that Shaposhnikova. Look how big her swing is. Full extension. That's what the judges want to see. Tkachev right to a pack salto. Ooh, she's out of alignment. She is so physically strong. She pulled it right back in. I don't think the judges are even going to deduct for that. Winding up for the dismount. A double pike. Surprisingly easy. Tremendous contrast between Prodenova and her teammate Svetlana Horkina. This is an extremely powerful, like a spark plug, on the Russian team. 9 6 8 7 as she's greeted by Leonette Arkayev. At her first World Championships, Veronique Leclerc of Saint Hubert, Quebec. Speaking of a dynamic spark plug, this is Canada's own. Fantastic vault, front front pike with a half. She's always excelled on this event. She's naturally strong, explosive, but the form is important. Look how neat, how clean. There are no deductions there for execution. 9-3-2-5 is the score on the first vault. They will average the two for a total. She's coached by Michelle and Danielle Chiron. And this is her event. Front, front, pike. She decides not to do it with a half twist. They want to show two different vaults. Now the start value, the degree of difficulty, is slightly lower. That'll be reflected in the score. There's her coach, Michelle. Average is 9-2-6-2, two, and that's a good mark for the Canadian Veronique Leclerc. On the floor, Simona Aminar, and a look at one of the great Romanians. Oh, she certainly is, Scott, but this is one lucky Romanian to even be here. Double lay looks solid, but Simona didn't even qualify for the individual all-round. Although it looks as though she should have. Powerful tumbling. Simona struggled in the qualification meet on balance beam and actually fell. So she didn't qualify to be here. Octavian Balloon knows what she's capable of and decided to pull out teammate Alexander Marinescu. She's sitting on the sidelines. And this is Aminar's day. Multiple medalist from Atlanta won gold in the vault, silver on the floor exercise, and was third all around. Scott, she's just a great tumbler. She's already done three major tumbling lines, but we know she has a fourth one planned. showing any signs of fatigue. A well-conditioned athlete heads toward punch front. Triple twist, tough to do at the end, even tougher to do in a combination like that. It is certain that the future of Romanian gymnastics is secure. Simona Aminar, just 16 years old. And tumbling is definitely the strength of her program. Here's the whip to the full and back out in the tuck position. Now watch what she's got to do. Punch it way up. There's the full twist. She's going to grab those legs to accelerate the rotation. That's how she flips faster, gets the feet down just in time. 9-7-7-5 for Aminar on the floor exercise. You knew it was going to be between the Romanians and somebody. Meantime, Yvonne Tusek of Canada is moving right along to the uneven bars now. Here's something for you. She's being spotted by Leonid Arkayev of Russia. Now, Scott, I find that so incredibly surprising. You would expect that the national team coach, Andre Rodnienko, would be out there spotting her. But this would allow her female coach, Saudi, to stay in the competitive venue. You're only allowed one coach per athlete. So Saudi can stay in. Arkayev gets up on the podium. And you know what? I think this strategy may work quite nicely. Yvonne is performing beautifully. Big release moves in this program. And I think the judges are going to want to know, who's this Canadian kid being spotted by the god of gymnastics? It's got to help her score. Certainly inspired a great deal of confidence in Yvonne Tusek. Look at this. Huge Hindorf. 
I'm sure Lean at Arkhayev was impressed. <laughs> And the results are great. 9-6 for Yvonne Tusek, and she is moving up the rankings in this all-around competition. After three rotations, Gina Gojan leads, followed by her Romanian teammate, Aminar. Elena Prodinova is third. The women are on the march to their final apparatus. We'll have it when we return to Switzerland.